I caught it before anybody yelled at me. <laughs> Buck here. Welcome to Fishkin with Buck. Um, we're going after trout tonight. And I put a pole up on the lodge uh, about an hour ago. And because I didn't know where to go, but I wanted to go somewhere where we had a chance of catching a lot of trophies and unis. And not ones that we have to wait a long time <laughs> to try to grab these guys up. And we did pretty good last night. Um, I think we caught 22 unis between three of us last night down at Quanchkin. So that worked that worked out pretty good. We got we got some pretty good cut points for that. I gotta get over to this, over to the lodge right now and get it turned on. <clears throat> get these guys, cut them loose so they can start yelling at me. But Coach and I were discussing this. We had just been to Rocky Lake two weeks ago. So I was kind of hoping everybody on the pole would jump all over Falcon Lake because we haven't been on Falcon in a very long time. In fact, I went back through my notes here. I think it was August was the last time we were down in Falcon. So maybe we should go to Falcon, I'm thinking. I mean, we're still, if you geared your, if you geared your tackle boxes up for Rocky Lake, well, it still works for Falcon. It's the same gear. So you won't, you'll be all right there. And we're probably better off. With Falcon, we can take a boat. So we can have guys on the shore and we can have guys in the boats. Rocky, we're kind of stuck all around the shore. It's only those two spawning joints. And last time, two weeks ago, we were at Rocky. I mean, we had six, I think six or seven of us were there. It gets pretty tight along the shoreline there. So, I think unless anybody screams at me, let me go over there. Let me go over there to the Discord server. Let's get let's get these guys cut loose. Okay. Ooh, we got a tie. Did we get a tie? Uh oh. <laughs> we got we got five people want to go to Falcon. Well, I guess Falcon won out then. They came in late. Come in running late. All right. <laughs> we got a tie. <laughs> That's kind of where I wanted to go. All right. Juju's all right with them. Juju's all right with it. All right, let's go over. What's what's Smokey doing? I'm gonna be a bit. Okay, Smoke, got you, buddy. No problem, man. We got coaching. I'm sure Caliber will be. Let me get over there to the lodge now. Get those doors cut loose. Where are we out here? That ain't it. Why can't I ever find this thing? I moved everything around. I don't know where it is now. There we go. All right. All right. That fired up, I think. We're going over there. Oh, let's be back after dinner. Falcon sounds great. All right. <laughs> oh, Wheezy Moss, you got to go easy with that. Now, this is an international club. All right, see, now you got me going here just thinking about the damn joke. I'm not telling it. All right. Well, let's, Buck, let's get, your, let's get your gear up over there and get over, get over there alive, brother. All right. <clears throat> there we are. So, what's Buck taking? Well, we were down there last night down at Quanchkin, so we were hunting big flatheads and stuff, so I had some pretty heavy gear over there, so, well, I, I changed everything out real quick. Um, trout gear. That's basically these are my two biggest poles, and those are but just two two bottom rods. You know, two like uh, feeder poles, bottom rod, light bottom rods. All right, so I got two of them. Uh, got the old fruitcake here from the Christmas deal. He's a thirteen pounder, so we're gonna use him as a bottom rod for these trout. It'll work just fine. And brought a couple of them out. There's also at Falcon. There's there's really a nice place over there. We'll, and I'm going to show everybody this hole tonight. Um, I was I was fishing it the other night on Steam uh, to get my club points. And I was just banging Trophy Oregon red bands out of this hole on a number eight hook and crickets. And that's the only trout I was catching out of this hole. I shouldn't have been. Was, this, is my, this is my red ear sunfish pumpkin seed hole. That's, I was over there just trying to catch... Trophies and unis, you know, left and right, which is they just feed you trophies constantly out of this hole. 
So that's how I that's how I actually made the three hundred points uh, to get the club into the leagues on Steam was right in that hole. So we're gonna go over there. All right, but um, we can have a boat here. So make make sure you, you get yourself a nice kayak to go over there. Um, I got this Thanksgiving canoe. I'm gonna use it. And that's a small lake. I'm not worried about getting anywhere fast. I don't have to worry about tuckering out. It's kind of cool. So we're going to take that. I need to use him up a little bit so I can do a performance video on him. He's a new one I got. All right. So with that being said there, guys, um, let's jump over here. I got everything I need there as far as my sticks go. Let's go click on Falcon here. There we are. Let me go get a license book. And this is, a, this is actually a nice... It's still a cheap waterway. We can get away with this trip for 6900 bucks, Everything included. All inclusive for 6900 Not bad. So, we'll take that. And we will get ourselves on a plane and get over there to Falcon Lake. All right. That gives me a chance to jump over here on Discord. Get that going that going okay here we go oh i never sent that message all right now i sent it limits 50 the batteries what why is he talking about that now <laughs> all right except here we go all right <clears throat> All right, I didn't even do this. Ain't got any moderators on yet. All right, they'll get here. All right, we are here. Well, where do we want to start out at? Well, I was just having all kind of fun with the brown trouts. Um, over against the wall here. We could actually start over there. Catch up on something. We'll make some money real fast. Get me to catch a couple of these. Um, my little hole. <clears throat> the little hole is right over in here for the panfish and where I was catching those every single. I caught 12 of them on crickets on a number four hook. I, 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 a number number eight hook. Sorry. I'm using number eight. Number four is supposed to be the lowest preferred size hook for these red bands. But crickets, number eight. And I caught 12 of them right out of that hole. So we'll go hit that at some point today. All right, let's get a club room going, Buck. Yakking time. All right, uh, where do we want to start? This bridge is good to start. Maybe we'll start over here and grab up. A, see if we can get a couple over here. Eh, we can walk around. We'll walk around. We'll start over here. Buck, we'll start over here. Let's go fishing. Boy, that's taking forever. Okay, but uh, there's a buck over here. We'll get started over here. Uh, back her up a little bit. I'll get the camera and keep it filming. Uh, I guess we'll go right. For other folks. Well, let's see here. Where are we going to start? Well, let's start with the big guys. We'll put them out there first. Right, I got mayflies on here. Barbus hook, number one. That should be pretty good for these, for these brown trout. And I'm just going to throw all along the wall here, guys. I got one little hole out there marked. It's just that, that you guys, everybody knows how deep and how good it is out there. So we're just going to throw them right out in there. Let them start ringing. All right, so number four. Oh, I got the keys programmed yet, Buck. You didn't get started. You didn't get everything done. All right, six. What do we got on him? Now, same thing. Number one, but grasshoppers. Drop him in. And I'm using my target thing here, guys, so you can see where I'm throwing. I, I normally don't use this, but makes it easier on the video so you know where I'm dropping it in at. 
take this next one. We got I got artificial eggs on him. This is just a little 13 pounder. This would be a lot of fun when we hit those brownies on this. <laughs> uh, what do you got next, Buck? What's in line next? Uh, I don't think that's going to work. Not here. bottom buck 98 what do you got on there blood worms that's probably not good We can get started with that. See how that goes. Get the fireworks start. It didn't take long at all. Okay, Buck. See what you did wrong here, now, didn't you? Look at the bobber you got on there. The port bobber on there. You know you ain't throwing that nowhere, don't you? All right, we want we want Max, but we're throwing for Trout, so we'll throw. We'll pull, put the chubby on there. You're about that chubby's about dead. Now maybe you can get out there to the lily pad, huh? There we go. Good. All right. Now that we corrected Buck's first mistake of the night. And again, guys, remember that. You know, that bobber, that bobber has a lot to do with <laughs> the success of your fishing. Um, for, you know, if you want to get out there the furthest distance, you throw one of them egg bobbers. Well, they, they call them pear, pear bobbers in this game. I've always known them as an egg bobber. I guess they look like an egg, too. But that'll get you distance. But you don't want to use them, really, when you're fishing for trout. They're kind of heavy. Trout aren't, aren't very good fish for... They don't, they don't want to detect resistance on the bite. Kind of like a panfish there, unless you fly fishing. Of course, then there's no bobber. You know they they like to hit them flies hard. But we can't fish the proper way. I mean, what you put you put a fly on a match rod and it's supposed to sink? I don't know. I like to see that happen. There's our little fruit cake. That ain't no brown, now is it? Damn, it is. It's a little one. There, pick that pole up. What are you guys doing way out there? All right, we're going to go to something else. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, how about some dragonflies, Buck? Yeah, we could. Let's go see the dragonflies. See if we can get a brownie on this thing. I don't think I can. Yep, that's a little much. Oh, I hope it's not a brownie. Uh, let's see, we'll go to the bottom.
wall, Buck. Feeder pole, Buck, not your match, Rod. Halfway. Trophies here. Let's take a look. <clears throat> what do we got going in? Clubs. Why does? Why are you in St. Croix? Well, we're all on. <laughs> okay, twenty six eighty three. We got. All right, guys. We're in bad shape, though. How far behind are we? We're way behind. Way behind. We've got a lot of fishing to do. Trophy. Let's just check our... Ah, okay, fast forward time. We want to go to 11. No, no. Uh, what do you got here in his hand? Crickets. Pocahontas here, mounted on a tomahawk. We got a... Okay. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Easy, buck. Club one. Come on, come on, come on. Young. Oh boy, we only got one point for him. Throw over there, we're going to get smallies on that. Throw over here. Ooh. What you got there, Buck? Maybe. We ain't got nobody here, though, to make maximum club points. Mm. 
no trophy there. I love these big river engines, guys. Especially the 6500 with that 40, 49 or 47-inch recovery. Let's go turn them bite alarms down. We handle that two hours. I don't have me beating my head on the doorway over there. Uh-oh. Coming in the back door. We got him. <laughs> I love to go for a ride over them rocks anymore. Love all those new fish mechanics, huh? That didn't bounce off the wall. No sense in pulling that damn flipping stick out. Every time I pull it out, one of these goes off. And now I'll sit here and they won't go off. Once again, guys, I you know I said I talked about this in my fishnet videos, and I talk about it quite a bit. If if you guys are you know if you're purchasing DLCs, um, right there, those two little guys I got right down there, because I didn't buy that that whole. Like I said, um, if I were to do it all over again, that would be the the DLC I'd start off with in this game. Would be the sport bundle. However. If you're just shopping for a couple of sticks, you know, like I did, I just, these were cheap. I think they were $5 or 6 bucks, and you got good fishnets with them. So I got bigger fishnets. I got these, you know, when I was a lower level player, and that got me, you know, my fishnets that I needed to get up there. Of course, you get the same one if you buy two of them, so you can only sell one and make some, you know, make some good gold on it because it's a DLC. And if you're doing like I'm doing on the... What? <laughs> 20 feet down, huh? Okay. If you're not doing the DLCs, uh, then you want to grab yourself the big alley, the biggest, the biggest feeder. 
as fast as you can. Because that is your bottom rod. That's your bottom rod until you get to level 33. I think it's 33 when the bottom snipers come available. else is here but Bunny you should just get in your point I'm only gonna make well I'm not catching fish fast enough here so I'm not catching trophies too much time here, Buck. We're here for club points, not fish. do i was thinking about it but we don't have all night Uh-oh, what's that? There ain't nothing in here gonna... What's going on? No way. I have that thing set on that. Put me up in a red dude. What's up with that? Hello. Hi, Jules. Still no trophies. <clears throat> Got to get the trophies, guys. Dang it. Small mouth, stay away from that left side over there, Buck. Throw down the middle. This guy's missing. I think something's wrong with that number seven pole. There's absolutely nothing wrong with the pole. Where'd the dude go? Number one, what the hell am I? I need to go to that. Ah, well, that's stacked up somewhere. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. Don't worry about it, Buck. Don't worry about that. Yep, get him in. The other guy ain't gonna wait. He's not gonna wait around very long.
mama I think my dragon fly Stay a little shorter buddy stay away from them small ones Another red air sunfish. That's the end of these grasshoppers. I come in now. Oh, finally we get a trophy. Finally. <laughs> All right, three points. That's good. Ah, uh, Jules, you just made it. I got three points on that one. Good job. Otherwise, I would have got two. All I think. Right. Oh, maybe you didn't make it yet. That's why I only got three. I should have got four points for that trophy. That's right. I should have got four. There you be. Jules, uh, are you using ground bait? No. No. You got. I want to live on wild bug juice. <laughs> <laughs> you got a feeder cage on there instead of a sinker. <laughs> I got the log. Okay. <laughs> I'm the biggest I have. I get a log. All right, that's it. That's it with the grasshoppers yeah. in the last year. I mean, they do have weight to them. Oh, yeah. oh, oh, look how buck. The little one has. There, there's a big one. Oh, these guys getting my rods clear into the red. I got something wrong with that. Those are 18 pound rods. And I ain't yeah, put. I'm, this is a seven I'm pound. Having, uh, yeah, that's. Like, yeah, something ain't right there. Catching these fish on a seven pound pole and it ain't putting it in the red. Uh oh, where are you going? Pole. Oh, it's all bent out of shape. Something's a little bit weird here tonight. There's the brown. Come on, boy. Nine. Making money, but only one trophy so far. This is going to get me again. What time? Uh, 11 o'clock. I fast forwarded. I'm at 11. I'm actually at 12 o'clock now. I'm getting ready to go over there to my little panfish hole where I can catch 12 to 20 trophies an hour. <laughs> That's what I'm thinking here. I'm going to I'm going to give it a little more. I'm going to give it a little more time here chasing these. I figured I'd get a bunch of but the trout that paid money and then go chase the sunfish and the and that don't pay any money. But we'll get more club points that way. There we go. Oh, 
Bye. And we finally got something biting on that fourth call. Yeah, I'm, ha I'm having troubles with the smallies eating all the bait up here tonight. This afternoon, I should say, this afternoon here. I'm, catch I'm catching more smallies than I want to be catching. I wouldn't mind it if they were trophies. We ended up we ended up with twenty two unis last night. Wow. <laughs> that was that was pretty good. I I picked up I picked up my eighth one right before I left. <laughs> Why is that? That's insane. That should not be on Fisher's case. Isn't that wonderful? Smallmouth bass. Why is it? Look at this. Look at that. What is wrong with that? What's wrong with this picture? There's no way I should have to put this this drag clear down that low for these fish. That's in, that's not. Oh, that bell's got to go, Buck. Turn the damn thing down, buddy. Fix that right now. Why is that up so loud? I'm more concerned why my damn feeder poles are maxing out. That ain't, that ain't cool at all. That's the end of that beaver. All right, Buck, get clear out here then. Get as far away from them smallies as you can. They're everywhere. I dare try to run to the kitchen sink for a glass of water. <laughs> <laughs> nope. <laughs> That's all I had to say.
here's another trophy. Yay. Oh, nice. All right, leave that guy out of the water and run. Should have filled that water glass up before I started. All right, now we're here for what? I've got a red band on TV, and this guy over there, right? Go into the red. Something is definitely wrong. Got my lightest quiver tip on here. <laughs> Getting three points for him. Well, there he is. Run, Morris. Yeah, yeah, since he's gone. Oh. <laughs> I think that. I was like, he's at St. Croix. Well, he's still at St. Croix. <laughs> <clears throat> Croix is still bubbling. This is good. <clears throat> we got a long way to get. To, yeah, we got a long way to get to twenty-two thousand. I can't, I still can't figure this out. <laughs> These are not big fish. Three pounds. This one out, Bucks. What are we going to do here? Keeps going in the red. Boy, what would I do if I caught a real big fish? <clears throat> It'd probably snap my line. Well, unless these new fish mechanics, I haven't fished with these poles yet since that came out. Oh, the, the scrawl. Scrawl's online. There we go. That's good. I don't know, <clears throat> Jules. I think we're gonna. I think we're gonna go hunt trophy panfish at eight o'clock. Why? Because we're not. We're not getting enough trophies here. I what we really need is that green fish. One fish. Yeah. All right. We got. We got to change up your luck. Yeah. 
And The shrimp boat from Forrest Gump. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> yeah. Thousand bucks more, and we got our expenses covered. Well, do you have your 30 day challenge done yet? <laughs> well, do it at night so it doesn't co cost you nothing. That's, that's 68 days. <laughs> That's six thousand eight hundred and forty dollars for five days. <laughs> you have to get all your gear and your equipment on a trip down to Florida. Well, that's what you need, definitely, to trip the blue crab. Blue crab or California? California, you make the most money, but you gotta have sticks. That's the only problem. If you try to go to California at that level, um, with the sticks you can buy, you'll get you'll get beat to death. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I, I fill up my 1,300-pound net at Blue Crab by 1030 in the morning, and I don't fast forward or nothing. I don't care what day it is. It doesn't matter if it's raining or what. How about it, Jules? Buck fills his net up there. <laughs> well, that's kayaks and Oh, there's my trophy, Brown. All right. Do what now with kayaks? You know, you know how long that takes <laughs> in a kayak. <laughs> well, that's no that's no different than the fishing trip that I'm in the middle of filming, which is 
orchid shore in kayaks. Hmm. That one will be coming out as soon as I get back to the Amazon and get back in hey, there. Hey. That one will be coming. Oh, ah, well, that's good. And then you can get more points. Well, Jules, we got six minutes, and then are you ready to panfish hunt? Yeah. All right, we'll go get a bunch of we'll go get a bunch of trophies out of that hole. I gotta see if my if it works the same way here on <clears throat> Windows as it did on my Steam account. I can't believe that I caught twelve trophy red bands out of that mm -hmm. hole on on a number eight hook. I, I just I, I still I'm I'm flabbergasted over that. <laughs> what are you using for bait? Um, right here, right. Mm. Yeah. Let's see. Who's producing? <laughs> well, I kind of started here. This is this is good for. Usually I catch quite a few more trophies than I'm doing tonight. I would have to say what's producing the most here. Mm, equal across the board. Equal across the board. Nothing's I up. caught a friend. <laughs> Ah, that don't get us no damn points. <laughs> oh, Jules, get a free download. Yeah, a three pounder. <laughs> oh, oh, aren't you witty? <laughs> Come on, Rod, hurry up. Crank this thing in. I got one bigger than. I think down there waiting on me. Oh no, it's probably a sunfish. Not rod. They're tough. Yeah. That's a tough one to come fish. by. Whatever fish they swim with. Yeah, they should. All right, Jules. I'm going to take a walk. I'm tired of this hole. All right. I'll be over there in a minute. Okay.
Alrighty, kid, I'll see you over there. Over. <laughs> I don't know how to get up in that tree like you do. Which, just walk into it. And then it's like you gotta turn around and go into another tree. That tree where which tree is it? That one. No, you can't get to that one. No. <laughs> I think it was this tree over here we were in. The tree? Coach can do it. Pop Stewart did it. Next, next tree on the list. Is it this one? Or this one? There it is. I got it. Come on. There we go. I'm in. Oh, I'm falling down. There it is. Come on, get up there. I don't, I don't know how to do it. I can't do it. <clears throat> All right. This is where we're going to set up shop. All right. First of all, I want to get right to the right spot or my rods ain't going to flip right. I hope you got it right here, Fox. That flipping stick out. That might be the. There we go. Right where we want to be. Holy crap! Did you get? Oh, she's. Yep, she's making it. There we go. Buck, I think this is about the spot you want to be in. Let's see. Do 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 do. Oh, right there. Oh, view. And we're going to back it up just a hair. That should do it. Let's put the rod stand. Well, I got to make sure you can flip this one over there first. Because this is one adjusted. Hey, man. <laughs> <laughs> Make it? No, it's too short. Buck. I'm proud of it though. Let me get closer. Mm. All right, that'll work. I'm going to have to try that. Oh, yeah. 
I don't know. How to, I'm not like I said. I ain't a very good gamer. I don't know how to make my avatar climb the tree. I did get up in it once. I have to practice more. Hmm. All right, Buck. Put him down there. Get this deck on it. You don't even know what you had on now. This is more than you had on. Yeah. Okay, so catch a number. Look at this. Trophy Oregon okay. Red Band on Dragonfly, number four hook. Okay? I don't care what I catch them on. Give me the trophies. What I want to know, Coach, is whatever possessed you to attempt to try to climb a tree? I have no problem doing that. Oh, now trophies got jewels here now we're gonna need to start slaying them I gonna need to go to some semolina balls and the other one that'll get me my trophy pumpkin That ought to get us a few. Wait for him to start hitting, Buck. Have some patience. It's coming. Here, Buck. Ooh. Well, I need a trophy, but that's three points. Well, my theory holds true, though. I can guarantee you a trophy Oregon Red Band 
on this lake at any given day, at least, guaranteed you're going to catch one out of there. All right, he ain't no trophy buck. that get a get a basic license <laughs> get a basic license you'll catch a lot of trophies <laughs> there's my trophy oregon there it is every one of them i'll be damned oh i gotta love this fish over there throw down deep throw against that wall for hours on end and catch maybe one trophy. I think I got two over there on that wall. I got two already here. Yeah, that goes with one buck. This goes two goes in your hand. Where's my trophy? Where's it? Where's the trophy? Where's the trophy for it? Uh oh, the hooting and hollering will be starting in 10 minutes. You'll be hearing it all down here. The Chiefs kick oh. off. The Chiefs are kicking off at 820. Oh, Wheezy Mouse is already situated. Look at that. Oh, it's called Cricket's number eight hook. <laughs> There's the third one. Unbelievable trophy. trophy. I'm telling you guys, this is it. points. Twenty eight sixty six. Oh, we better get to three thousand tonight. You need you need large minnows. All right. There, coach. Bigger, but there's no trophy yet. Come on. There you go. You got one, Jules. All right, Buck, hold your pole up higher when you flip it in there. It won't throw it as far. Good call. I need better than that. There's my trophy, Paul Good Seed. That a boy.
about to go to quiet here, buddy. What happened? That's impossible. I've never run out of fish in this hole yet. <laughs> there he goes. Oh. Uh oh. Looks like Coach is having internet problems again tonight. Unbelievable. You pay good money for that service. They should reimburse you every time it goes down. Don't think I've ever seen that bird flying up there before. Hmm. Okay, he's yakking. Let me see what this is. There's a fat boy. Oh, he ain't no trophy though. Just missed it. Hey, where are we at now? I'm up to 10,000. That'll cover the expenses. Twenty nine oh two. We need 100 points to make 3,000 club points. <laughs> That's all. That's all. There's a fat boy up there.
Look at that boy. There we go. Thank you very much. Some more dragonflies over here. Oh, I'm going to have to get one with my gang. Let's go back. Flipping Every one of them. Every one is a trophy. <laughs> it's amazing. Well, we get screwed over here because you can't, it's not like you can change providers. You know, Comcast owns half the freaking internet providers in the freaking country. There's a monopoly going on, I can tell you that. Xfinity. Hey, uh. They bought out all the small cable companies all, all across the the whole United States, they own, they own damn near the whole internet over here. Now you, now you got a bunch of mobile guys trying to come in. T-Mobile's trying to provide home internet service. And Verizon. 
Verizon has fiber, but you call around like I can't even go to fiber. I don't know. Verizon ain't put no fiber to the curb yet. You're stuck with Comcast. I'd love to have. Fiber to the curb. You, I mean, you don't, you don't really have another choice, do you? You can't switch providers, can you? Oh, you can. Oh. No, our ours is absolutely ridiculous. I mean, I have the I have the lowest cable package that you can even get. <clears throat> the lowest cable package. I get twenty channels. That's it. And I have high speed, the highest speed internet that they can give me. And I pay a hundred and fifty eight dollars a month for that bullshit. Wow. Yeah. That's ridiculous. There's my joke. At Christmas? Yeah. Oh, they they all tell you you get 100 megabytes. You don't get that. You don't see nowhere near that. And I call Comcast up. My dad, you know, I dude, dude, don't try to feed me no crap. I'm a computer engineer. I've been throttling your damn. I've been measuring your your throughput. I got a protocol analyzer on my link. You're not delivering me. <laughs> like now, I hear is click, hear click. I go into the I go into the phone store there, and then all of it don't take five minutes, and I'm storming out of there, slamming doors. Bunch of idiots behind the counter and couldn't tell you which end of the damn phone gives you dial tone. It sucks when you spend forty years working in the telecom industry. And you got to sit back and listen to some Yahoo customer service rep that don't know nothing. Try to explain to you that, oh, no, sir, you're, you are getting the throughput that we advertise. Who are you trying to shit? Salvage. 
My buck, what happened here? Are we like completely off the peak? No, we got two more hours. What do you mean? Good deal. Well, there it is. Back to Singapore. Well, there you go. There you go. one thank you very much Be a smart thing to do, maybe. Well, I kind of like that idea. I don't live in a city, so you know, if they're bringing my towers next to me. I'm more. I'm happier. <laughs> It's got a concrete sidewalk. You ain't going to find bucks as close to it. Okay, so they just stupidly planted the tower for no reason. Yeah. <laughs> Only to explain that you can go to get full coverage in the national park. But that's where all the tourists are. Thank you. 
That girl, Jules. Oh, trophy rainbow. That's yeah. nice. Yeah. Yep. On here. I don't like to wait more than 30, 40 seconds. Thank you. There we go. Getting pretty close. Oh, we're we're well. We must be killing here pretty good tonight. We definitely we we made our thirty thousand or three thousand. Three hundred gets you in, but you got to look at where the first the where the top three spots are at. They're in the twenty two thousand range. We don't want to be. We don't want to be third. We either want to be first, second, or fourth. Yeah. Third sucks. You don't get nothing. I want to be the third. First would be nice. You want that boat, don't you, Jules? I'll get a pretty blue boat if we take first place. <laughs> I hope Santa brings me cash. Are you opening your word on me? <laughs> Rotary you know what I you know, I had a deck building business for the last oh there he is there's a tra there's a uni juice <laughs> there you go nice job Pulled away. You? I'm lagging. I'm lagging. <laughs> Marking that one, are you? All right. Uh -huh. Well, they, you can actually buy lure blanks that come, they're just unfinished and you yeah, paint them in. Are they? Make your own, make your own blueprints, make your own pieces, more valuable, make better actions, you can detail them yourself. Oh, but the main thing is making a good wooden boat. You can hit a bridge, that Yeah. <laughs> 
Don't be hitting the bridge. <laughs> Like Walmart lures, my gosh! Don't ever buy a Walmart lure. Kills all dogs. What is this? Live bank gold plate from what? Create this bug study. If a grub on the end. I've only ever caught one muskie in my life. I'm I'm still in search of that big boy. I, I, they're tough to come by. Whaler, huh? You want me to get a whaler so I can go ocean fishing? <laughs> it's kind of small for the ocean, but okay, go ahead. Right. That's a life bait tank for cutting board rock. That comes from a lot of ocean. That's a big bug. Like a giant lamp. <laughs> Yeah. One hundred thousand, one hundred thirty-one thousand dollars per hundred thousand. Mm -hmm. That's about right. Eastward, look up on the line. It's a fishing boat, though. It ain't just a regular old boat. That's a fishing boat. <laughs> now you can pay a hundred thousand for a nitro bass boat. I personally wouldn't go that route because it's fiberglass, but I like my I like my metal boat. I can run over stuff. <laughs> Yeah, that's why I think you're going to love this. Whalers off the fiberglass. This is going to ruin you. Yeah, I, I'm not much on the fiberglass boat stage, truth, unless it's a ski boat or something. You know, that's different. But even them, I don't really like the fiberglass. I just, you're both fiberglass boat? No. No, you still said check that out on stream. Ah.
or as the British say, aluminium. <laughs> aluminium. Oh, he, he's not a Brit. No, but aluminium is the, is the uh, universal standard. It's aluminum. <laughs> I want to hear him say cinnamon next. <laughs> cinnamon. <laughs> the thing that he put on bread last night. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck, why are you throwing it on the rock? I told you that. Stop it. Now look, your, your, your red band stuck on the rock over there. Another trophy. Control, why didn't it work? Wow. And my new boat, honey. Ha <laughs> my new boat, honey. <laughs> new boat. I like that. I like I like that one. You gotta you gotta put that boat up put it up on the server. <laughs> I don't know where we could put it. Put it in general chat. I don't care. Fishing planet. Put it in fishing planet chat. That'll work in fishing planet chat. It's fishing boat. Whoa. <laughs> I've been on many boats like this, so. Eh. Well, I've been on <laughs> It's a fancy ass fucking trailer. The boat itself is pretty run of the mill. For most of the charter boats I've been on are just friends who like to go out salmon fishing on the weekends. Yeah, but don't forget, that is the basic model. Yeah, the one that's only 130,000. <laughs> yeah. I really don't want it. I like it. I'd take it any friggin' day of the week. And, uh, I and it's like, if you gave it to me, would I take it? Yeah. But am I gonna go out and ever spend that kind of money? No. Nope. Uh, I would. I'd spend that kind of money on a nice boat like that. I, I could probably get one over here that's actually compatible with that for probably a little less than that money, though. It's actually a kiwi boat for a month. Kiwi. They're all handmade in New Zealand. Oh, well, there you go. I guess I'm not going to get anything over here that compares to that, quality-wise. Well, no. you, well, the closest one is Michigan. Michigan. I know where it's at, too. Yeah. Buck, I'm not showing you. I'm gonna I'm gonna be nice and save you. <laughs> <laughs> Don't even ask, I'm not giving you directions. <laughs> I can tell Buck where it is right now. <laughs> I can find it. <laughs> it's in Fairhaven. <laughs> you just need to shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to put this. Take it to the 
Maybe my buddies wouldn't be so petrified when they ride with me in that one. Ah, they probably still would be. <laughs> they they have a problem riding in my bass boat with me. <laughs> Do you realize what could happen <laughs> at these at these speeds? Well, yeah, if you're not paying attention, a lot of things could go wrong. <laughs> They're different. They're different. We have a name to you for all of us. That's just puppy dog. We go on and on about it. Yeah. You're talking about the cigar boats. Well, it's a cow boat. It's an animal boat. I, I don't... It's unstable. It rocks back and forth. And it cannot be reeled at all. Oh. Hmm. Well, I see... I see guys on Lake Erie constantly because they don't know what they're doing. And, uh... They they sink those forty thousand dollar bass boats like mine all the time, because they they shouldn't be out where they're out in a bass boat. <laughs> Remember, Remember. Did, you ever, did you ever see those in there? They have those bunged out to fly. <laughs> they uh. They, they they normally they normally wait too long. And uh, by the time they think that they to react, it's already too late. They're taking on too much water. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Red sun. They just get up there right quick. And then they they kinda get to below that one or three. Yeah, I think I'm pretty sure Lunds Lunds are unsinkable. They they'll they'll even if you capsize them they'll stay on the surface. I'm pretty sure, right? Smoke is it a Lund or is it a whale? I don't want to say that the style of boat is unsinkable because you know that's not true. But you have to to really. Know your way around that boat. I see oh, a yeah. lot of guys use them for backwards throwing all the time to help control their speed. But the thing you have to remember is these guys burn a bilge pump out every year. Every year because of all that splashing, them trying to keep that boat up. If you stop using your bilge, a lot of those boats don't matter. Go down to all the same. <laughs> Yeah. Um, there's a, I, I want to say it's like a whaler, it's like a harpooning boat, but they come in all kinds of sizes. You can get them under 40 feet. They have, yeah, look, they have look, a yeah. sealed hull is what it is. So the hull has double walls all the way around oh, yeah. sealed. So you can't that's get what, water into it. Yeah. That's what the Navy has. Yeah. And a lot of, um, like charter boats will run something like this because like if they do take a big wave. Gonna, you know, rinse some stuff off. It doesn't matter. <laughs> like, but well, what I mean, Navy craft guns, like the Sea Dogs, they can sink in the sea area. Just uh, I think they throw a life threat in there. So is that such a small one? It ain't going to go any further than that. At that point, it's a life threat. That's pretty cool. So you got yourself like an, a watertight capsule that keeps the damn thing up. The air bubbles are in it. Well, we got five minutes here, Jules. Let's see what kind of what kind of club points did we end up with? 
3154 so far. Let's see, this is what I like. This tells the story on everybody who's making it. Thirty-four. Dank and Donuts. Dank and Donuts has six. He's running in second place. Dank is. We'll get there. We'll get there. Why doesn't that go back? Because of my escape work, I can't get back in the game. What happened? <laughs> that was weird. If you go and get a small bank, then I can give you a Yeah, I, I've got two minutes. <laughs> no, he ain't here tonight. But he, he might be listening in later. Oh, he watches he this. <laughs> Joel's got I'm one on over there. Picking, Who's so the other night he was like 15 minutes, 10 minutes, but 10 minutes, five minutes, but five minutes. Yeah. <laughs> Gets in well bucket, well bucket, well buckets. <laughs> oh, we see how you're trying to get them off the air already. Yeah, he was, well, see, because he, he was doing his job. He was hanging out. He was, because I told him it's not about a single individual fisherman. I don't care if, if you don't, if you have all the fish on this waterway already. We're fishing here. You're part of the club. You get your butt over here until yeah. we get more points. So he was there because of that. But he, he wanted to go play that other game. He, he wouldn't yeah. leave. He wouldn't leave. He, he, he was just hoping I'd end, I'd end the stream early so he could go. Uh -huh. Cause it, yeah. well, it, it wasn't, it wasn't, it wasn't one minute after I ended the stream and I, I went and looked to see what game he, he was already moved over to that other game. <laughs> oh, he stayed for the whole two hours. He fished with us. We, we scored points. We scored points because he was there. Well, he, he landed seven unis, I think six or seven. Um, two. Two, two, I ended up with two on the crankbait. I ended up with eight total that last night. 
which was pretty good for me. I, I don't usually, I don't usually slam eight of them. Yeah, you had, yeah, you had seven. All right, let me go in this year. I'll be right back. Let me go do, let me go do my thing. Do 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 do. do. All right, guys. Well, that's going to end it for tonight. We're still out there. We're we're on Falcon. We're still trucking at it. And we're going to try to get us some more club points here tonight. Um, couple of, that one spot. So if you guys are looking for a trophy red band, you saw where I, you saw me yank them out all night long. Just nothing but those. I mean, not even just nothing but trophy red bands out of that hole. It's amazing, and you can run them from number eight hooks all the way up to one hot. I was using a number eight and a number four over there, and I caught red bands on both of them. So, hope you got something out. I hope you had some fun hanging out with us. We always have fun on Fishkin with Buck. We'll be back next week. We'll be back next Saturday. Fishing with Buck. I don't know what waterway we'll be on yet, but we'll be somewhere. Caught. Guidelines, never, ever give up the fight. We'll see you later. <laughs>